Hello guys, this is Premium Milk. Here is my new project, the, the IMO Cup real footages. Here we have all the footages together in a sequence. So if you want this footage, you have to find into the folder placeholders, then same name, tablet static one, 16 seconds, tablet static one screen. You do have a click, here you can find, I have already an image, you can drag and drop your image your image has to be 3000 pixels to 1440. It is a retina display for the iPad with a long uh, version. So you drag and drop your, your JPEG footage here or your PSD file and appears automatically into the screen of the iPad. Scrolls, of course, it's called, it scrolls exactly as it works with the hand so this is it it is very easy to change the images the same thing for the laptop and the iPhone there are already as you see depth of field inside full quality inside here if you want to reduce the depth of field you have to go to the upper layer here the second layer excuse me there is a Gaussian blur you can go a 10 or 5 but the best is 20 because it matches with the video if you want more information you can drag and drop this mask excuse me on this like this you can customize some things here inside the scenes if you want if you are have familiar with After Effects here is the, the five color presets color preset one color preset 2, 3, 4 and 5. If you want to reduce the color preset you have to go to the opacity and go to 50 so you reduce all the color correction that it has. And Or you can keep the original file. After the mockups there are some stock footage that you can use to make your movie so this is it I hope you like it it's very easy to, to change something just drag and drop your layer here and hit render composition add to render queue if you want to render a specific clip you have to go to reveal layer inside projects in layer project this clip composition add to render queue and renders on a H264 without audio the format quality is 5 it's okay for a Vimeo or YouTube the better is 10 the compression that I have used for this uh, QuickTime movies there are QuickTimes with the format options of H264 to 2000 2000 kilo bps you can do the same 2000 it's a very nice quality for stock footage uh, video so this is how you render something of course you can render to H264 with this 10 or 20. It's all, all almost nice quality. And if you want to render something with a color correction inside, you have to go here and make your sequence 
to fit this layer. So if you go to composition, alternate queue, you render this clip with the color correction, with the color preset. So thank you very much. I hope you like it and uh, definitely there is going to be a volume 2 iMacup real footages. Thank you very much.